All right, everyone, we are going to cover Algo here really quick. So going on the Coinbase chart here uh, for Algo and going from the previous high, that was about three or the 2019 high of about 328 to 330, depending on what, you know, exchange you look at. But I just want to point something out to begin with here from that high to the low uh, here in 2021. Uh, or the 2021 bull run, you can see this thing got up to, got stuck at the 786 here, fell down, held support, and then pumped back up, making eventually a double top for that 2021 high, and then that was all she rode. Did not quite make it up to that previous high level, uh, as you can see here. So with that being said, let's get this one off of the chart. Let's just assume that Algorand's going to repeat history here. And from the high back in 2021, going down for three years, getting a double bottom bounce here. It is finally making higher highs and higher lows. It's curling up. And let's just say that we make a slightly lower high once again. And right now, I think it's sitting at a $3 billion market cap or a $1.8 billion market cap at the moment. So last cycle in 2021, it hit about $13 billion. So you can see that. If we come up here and make a slightly lower high, and we're just going to kind of guess here at about $2.30, you could see that would give you a rough $18.6 billion market cap on Algorand here. Now, if you're really bullish on Algo and you think it's going to break the 2021 high and come up to potentially the $7.20 range here, that gives you a $58 billion market cap on Algorand. Uh, so we'll see what happens. What do you guys think? Comment down below. But I just wanted to point out that if it repeats history here, uh, there's a potential for this general price area and maybe somewhere in the ballpark of an $18 billion market cap. And from the support level here, you're going to get about a 10x out of Algo. Now, looking on the much smaller Fibonacci here, you can see that going from the low here to the high, we fell below the 236 at 24. And we're coming back down to the 382, if you can see that they're in purple. And that matches right up with the 236 here. So we're coming back to back test. It looks like that 236 at 19, pretty much 20 cents here on Algo. But it is uh, going to continue our higher highs and higher lows scenario. So it is still bullish and very healthy for this thing to come back down. So you're looking to drop another 13% or so here on Algo. And then you should get a nice bounce back up. Now, with that being said, if you do bounce at that 236, the next resistance, of course, to get over is 33. And then the 0.5 here at 50 cents for a 154% move. Um, so ultimately, though, uh, we're looking for Algo to at least 10x this cycle. Maybe it's more bullish than I think, and maybe it does break the all-time high and come up here to this 1272. We'll have to just kind of wait and see what happens, but... With that said, not financial advice. Thanks for watching, everyone. Peace out.